Good morning everybody! I am making a video today of an unboxing of a Morphe Richard Superback. Oh, I just arrived at another... Ooh, oh, I've got another exciting I've got package. Paper that, you, that can turn into a bird yes. and a hand hoover. Yes, it is. Wow, it's a two-in-one cool hoover. So yeah, it turns into a hand hoover and it's a normal hoover and it's wireless. So I am very excited about this and I'm going to be unboxing it for you now. Okay, so we have opened the top of the box. On the side we have what I assume is some level of instruction manual. Always handy. And then we have... Uh, that looks like the charging base. Exciting. We have some accessories. Okay. And this one. I don't know if they attach onto each other like that. They appear to attach onto each other like that. Ha! I'm so clever. Look at me go. Right. And we've got a whole ton of cardboard, which we will take out. And then, some exciting things. Oh, Okay. So we have... I don't know what this is, because it looks like an actual hoover, but it's not. It's not. But it does look like what... Uh, the little bit something else will plug in here, and then... This, oh! Charging station, maybe? This is what I thought the other part... Oh! And this must be what actually charges it. And then this must attach in here. Oh, look at me being awesome and clever again. Um, yeah, this does go in here. Hmm. No, it's not the other way around. But it goes in here. There you go. Okay, anyway, like that. And then it should clip into here. And this plugs in. And then that's your charging unit, which is very exciting and cool. Because this can be quite small, so you can keep the Hoover small from what I've seen and have it just like this height and it can go into the sink and all sorts, so it's really convenient for charging the Hoover. Okay, next, we do have the actual brush attachment, which is very pretty and red and shiny. I like shiny, and there's a button here which I assume releases whatever attaches onto here. Um, and I don't know what this one does, I know that would be interesting to find out. That locks something in place. Hmm. Okay. And then, this is the last thing in the box, which is the main device. So, I'm going to do these over here. This is very cool because I can't get it all out. Sorry. Can't get it all out yet, but you can see that this is obviously there we go. This here is the actual vacuum cleaner, so you can use it on its own. Oh, got some power. Uh, this button here removes the um, that so that has the filter in it. Um, and obviously that will all empty at whatever you hoover up. So that goes in there and then in there. I don't think this has any purpose except looking pretty and shiny. And then, yep. Turns on. And that light turns on when it's on. So that's cool. And then this is what this plugs into. Yeah, like that, and then it <laughs> clicks up like that, and then this turns it on up here. Oh, and um, oh, there's a high, low, and off option, so that's cool. And then I do what I do really like is that this goes down here, so that when you are charging this on here it can be really small however at this point I don't know how we attach this to this that's not as intuitive hmm we shall see right and then this part obviously attaches on here <laughs> and then this is becomes the full vacuum cleaner which is 
awesome. And then the attachments, obviously, um, must live separately. There doesn't seem to be anywhere to attach them to the actual um, stand itself. So, unless there is on here, on the base, perhaps. Perhaps that's what this bit is for. Well, there's only one and there's two attachments, so I don't rightly know. But it's very pretty and it's very shiny and I'm very excited to give it a go. And I'm going to just quickly have a quick read and see how we charge it. Okay, I have read instructions. So this, right, this is very difficult to have up on this. Okay, so this part that we had that's all separate, all goes together, so this bit slides on here as before, and this goes into here, or that way around, goes onto there, and then this can attach to this part in here, so that you can have an extended brush when you're using just this handheld piece. So that's very cool. And then I can go back in, and then on the charging stand. which obviously it has the electric connection, so cables be plugged in. This whole thing can then sit on there, which makes it, keeps it together and nice and compact. That's a fantastic design, I love that idea. And then when we are charging this, this sits on the base here and it clicks in, so it's pretty secure. And then you can fold this down, which makes the whole thing really compact when it's charging, like it will fit in anywhere pretty pretty nice and, and snugly. So I'm very excited to use this and I will um, let you I will add on to this video how well it um, hoovers and our impressions on that. The other thing worth showing on this is obviously this detaches. Um, that's the purpose of this is you would use a coin to detach this and then you're able to take this brush out so that you can um, check both sides and are able to clean it properly and good old maintenance stuff. So that's what that's for. So that is first impressions. I love how easy everything um, attaches and how intuitive it is because I didn't need much help working that out. Um, I love that it's two in one. That'll make life a lot easier when it comes to um, wanting to clean out the car as well as running it around the living room. The purpose, um, the reason I bought this um, particular hoover was because I'm unable to use our big main hoover, um, I, I, well at all actually, it's just too heavy for me to use um, and I have a cleaner who comes once a month and she does use the big hoover which um, essentially hoovers through the whole house once a week but that is not enough, um, it needs to be hoovered at least, especially downstairs, needs to be hoovered every day. Um, and I did have a little handheld hoover, but it's completely disappeared. <laughs> so I've now bought this one and I'm thrilled because it's a lot better quality than um, the one I had before. Um, and it was a wonderful price on Amazon. I believe it still is. So if you're interested, go check that out. I'll put a link below. Um, it's down to £70 from 200 So that's a fantastic deal right now. Um, uh, but yes, either, to be fair, I don't think it's going to be any worse than the one I had before. So it can only be... A plus at this stage um, but yeah I'm very excited to try it out and I hope that this review was useful and I will add in some footage of it doing its job. <laughs> that is more than you